This is why it's so important to start with the locations in your description. And the formula is simply this. Number one, in your description, you need to start by listing the actual cities that you service. And number two, after you've listed those cities, you need to list the actual services that you provide. So let's take a look at a good example of an optimized description. So here inside of this home builder example, if we go down to the description, which you can see right here, let's take a look at this and break it down to make sure that it follows the formula that we just talked about. So it says right here at client name, we specialize in building custom homes throughout Northern Utah, including West Haven, Plain City, North Ogden, West Point, Far West, Mountain Green, Morgan, and Taylor Harrisville and surrounding areas. So right off the bat, you can see that they're listing all of the cities that they actually build homes in. And they're also saying the surrounding areas and they've even included a region here in northern Utah. So it's making it very, very clear. You're sending a signal to Google right off the bat. This is where we do the thing that we do. And this is really important because when it comes to the map pack, Google is trying to serve up results based on the location of the person that's searching for it. So if it says nowhere in your description that you service a certain city and someone in that city's on their phone looking up the service that you provide, it makes it really hard for Google to understand contextually that you even service that area. This is why it's so important to start with the locations in your description.